Hello, good evening. Wednesday, Wednesday. I feel like I need a theme song. I'm going to have to tell my um, musician friends I need a theme song. Um, there we go. Uh, good evening, everybody. Hi, my name is Tracy Weinsapple. Welcome to my studio. Uh, oh, Connie and Karen are watching together in Tennessee. Hello, Cassie, Robin, Elizabeth, um, Kathy, Kate. Uh, let's see, I have, uh, I think it was Diane over in Art Journaling for Beginners. Hello, Ottawa, Judy. Uh, glad to stay in with Tracy. I'm happy you're here too. Denise, Sharon, hi, Ann. Great meeting this morning. We had a nice meeting this morning planning for 2024. My calendar is full and we haven't even gotten there. Uh, a little nervous. Um, hi, how is everybody? So my name is Tracy Weinsapple. You're live in my studio. Every Wednesday I do a free demo, no obligation. I encourage you to paint a right along with me. Um, I went outside and grabbed a couple uh, of art journals. Uh, Diane said, I received my art journal you painted. It's so beautiful. Thank you. Oh, Diane, I'm so glad. I have like um, six remaining orders before my art and wine festival this weekend. And I felt bad, but they had to be done when um, they were a little bit late. I'm never late. I promptly ship. Usually if you place an order with me, it goes out the next day. But um, I had the art and wine festival. That was all my prep. And that's what I dedicated my time to. So thank you for being patient with me. Um, Yes, I still paint art journals. If you'd like to order from me, you can go to my shop and you can order an art journal and I will paint the art journal for the first page if you add that in your cart. It is not a free offering. It is $25, which is not a lot. Um, oh, uh, Elizabeth is camping in Ohio. They have the Bigfoot con convention in May. Okay. <laughs> uh oh, I think I gave you the wrong site. I did. I think I did. So, if you'd like to order our journals, yes, I have them. Yes, I'll still paint the first page. Um, I have, let me just drop the right shop link in there. Um, tonight, um, I am painting an art journal. Last week, I think no less than 15 emails. I answered the first email, but I'm going to paint in one of these watercolor art journals. I, I haven't decided yet. And then I offer the painting and you just buy the book and the shipping and the book is yours, but the painting is for free. So I'll do that again. It doesn't matter to me. If we, let's figure it's a nice way to paint for somebody else and the painting is included. Uh, let's see. I love the Ramona Bard Owls website. Cute sweatshirt. Thank you. Ramona Bard Owls. It's my friend Stacy's company. And yes, she really does have barn owls on her property right down the road from me. So if you like owls, she's the person to follow because legit they have barn owls with cameras. So you can see the owls doing the dirty. Um, and then from, from, and then they have the babies and then fledgling, whatever, all the words, all the terms, but you can watch Barn Owls all day long. So thank you, Stacey, for my sweatshirt. It's so comfortable. It's so comfortable. It's so soft. Uh, let's see, what do I want to tell you? So every week I do a free art journal or I do a free demo sometimes. It's oh, usually in the art journal if you're looking for something else. Um, join your artful journey. Uh, I will paint live. You're welcome to paint with me. I did not pick out whether I was doing watercolors or acrylic paints. You can just give me a suggestion. I'll look at that. I create from the space I'm in, so I don't have a pre-planned uh, schedule of what we're going to do. 
I used to, I kind of change back and forth between acrylic and watercolors. I'm a watercolor and acrylic artist. I really do not work in oils. So um, enjoy. Uh, let's see. Uh, many people were asking how my event went this weekend um, and talk to you about this. Yep. I have a class on wine glass painting. I had so many people asking. So we're doing it next Monday, uh, less than a week. You sign up. I do have the link. I have the link. No, I don't. Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Um, here we go. There's the link. Here's the class list. Okay. Um, here are the glasses from Harvest to Holiday. So we're going to paint Christmas trees and Aspen or birch trees. Um, and there they are. These were huge sellers for me. So that was all good news. Um, yes, I had my event this weekend. I did really well. I mean, I'm pretty impressed. I mean, you never know. Um, and when I paint, people saw my table and they wanted to know, did you sell out? No, I did not sell out of everything. Um, I, tip, I always do. Always. I always have. Um, I did not sell out, but I paint seasonally for all of the events I have. So what I do is I paint for, I probably will do no less than four more events, maybe three, depending on how, if I sell out. And then I have a retailer as well, or a couple of retailers, I should say. Uh, so I didn't sell everything that was on the table. Had I done that, that would have been like crazy. Um, I did not, but I didn't plan on it because like I said, I have four more events that I get asked to go to. And, um, so I did quite well. I was very happy with the success. My wine barrels, which many of you saw me paint those half barrel planters went for a whopping $900 that I didn't anticipate. And there was like, I mean, the guy, the, the auctioneer was like, what would you like to start at? It's like, I don't know, 100, 250. I don't know. You know, I was like, they started at 250 and it just went. Boop, 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 boop. So um, the wine glass painting class is Monday the 13th. If you can't be there live for the class, do not worry. It's uploaded into a portal and then you have unlimited access to it. Yeah, it was really successful. Um, like I said, I did not anticipate that they would go for as much as they did. Um, but there was a bit off between a couple of sisters and another lady. And the lady who was sitting right in front of me, she was so cute. She said, um, I'm only bidding to 500. I go, no problem. Like, I got you. And then the next thing I know, she's like, 650, 650. And I'm like, I'm telling her to stop bidding. <laughs> I was like, um, but no, uh, I did not. They were, they were cracking me up and the sisters split the barrels and each was taking one. So, um, I couldn't have been more thrilled and was kind of on an, uh, a real high from that. Uh, like I said, I'll do two or three more events. Uh, I just was asked to do a, I don't even know what you call it. Uh, it's a circle of musicians. There's going to be a bunch of musicians and then I'm going to paint while they're singing, uh, at one of our local, uh, wineries. I've never done that, but probably it's going to be me. You know how much I love to sing. It'll be me in the background singing really loud. Um, I'm so excited for that. I, I don't know why I said yes, other than I, like I'll have to paint on an easel. It might not be exactly what I normally do, but I'm going to just do it and I'm going to forget about it. But, and I'll sell the painting. Um, I'm, I'm really thrilled about that one. Uh, that's like at the end of November. So you know how much I love to sing. So maybe this was meant to be. That's what I have to say. Sometimes my friends say, I don't know you like to sing so much. I'm like, oh my God. Singing is like the most favorite thing. Uh, it really is. Uh, I think I'm going to paint in this journal. So I will 
offer this journal for sale. It's kind of like you need to first one to email me. Don't email me right now because you might not like it. Uh, but you don't have to pay for the painting. I'll just paint it live. You have to pay for the art journal and the shipping. Uh, and then I usually just take the first person and that's it. Uh, the first person in, and I send them an invoice. We call it done. I ship it in the next couple of days or so. Uh, that's pretty much. Did I cover everything? Wine glass painting class, November 13th. Um, actually, I'm, I'm going to change my mind. I'm looking at it and size matters tonight. I don't know why. I just feel like this one. It's a really nice journal, too. Oh. Thank you. Okay. I was debating if I felt like muted tones, if I feel bright. I kind of feel bright. It was really funny because I struggled a bit. I had like six journals to paint uh, that, you know, I was still, I had lots of orders for journals. Uh oh, sorry, I'll set my camera up while I'm speaking. And I had uh, uh, six of them to paint. And a couple of them, I crazy didn't really like, I liked the background, but it wasn't, it wasn't coming to me what I needed to paint on there and I paint from where I'm at in life and I was getting a little frustrated and I, I painted a really cool background but man alive when it came to me it came to me and I enjoyed it like I'm not going to send a journal out trust me when I tell you this I eat the cost of the journal the journal will be mine before I send something out that I'm not satisfied with. So if you ever order something for me and it takes a minute or two, first off, the journals take about five days because I let them cure and set and, oops, I don't want to film this in slow-mo. That would be horrible. That would be like, oh my goodness. Um, so just know that I am going to deliver you something that I would want or, you know, like, I'm not going to send out something I'm not happy with. That's not happening. So I, I really like almost wrote an apology to the one lady. Like this took me a little bit longer because I got stumped. And sometimes creativity flows and sometimes you just, but I pre-did the background and then I couldn't get past the background, but it was so cool. I loved the background. I just didn't know what to put over it. It was just the thing. You know, I'm honest. I tell you, but if you're, you know, paying for me to paint a journal and you need it tomorrow, it just doesn't happen. Unless you want this one, because I'm going to paint it tonight. And then I think I'm going to grab some watercolors. Watercolors, watercolors. Uh, mm -mm. I could just do this. I have, like, lots of sets of watercolors. But, like, oh, I don't want to paint that one. I think I used this the other week. What if I don't want to use any of these? Well, I work here for heaven's sakes. I can use what I like. Right? Uh oh, don't pick out something I don't already have open. That wouldn't be good. Ooh. Do I have? Oh, man. Hold on, I'm sorry. One should be prepared. I don't really want to open these. Well, I'm going to leave this out so I open them later. Dang it. I really wanted to use those. Hold on, I'm looking. Oh, this is another sand. They're all torn apart. All right, I'm going to go with the original set. That I picked out. You know what? I kind of love these too. Oh, okay. Okay. Oh, whoops, broke those. Okay. Well, 
I'm going to do a combo. I don't know where my classic set of watercolors, did they just crawl away in the night? I mean, you can't go wrong with the classics. Oh. Oh, thank God. That's a lot of looking for nothing. Well, I like this set too. Oh, a little jacked up. All right. Uh. <laughs> Everybody's saying, um, I, I'm pretty organized. It takes me forever to find stuff though. Painter's tape is what I'm using. This, uh, thank you. I, you know, I have OCD and I use it as a strength, not a weakness. It's a little nutty. I get it. I feel like just doing the background and then deciding what I want. I'm thinking. People ask, do I really just show up live and not know what I'm painting? I do. It's like a wonderful thing to do. Like these are some pretty vi vibrant colors. I actually love this set. So why not just use it? Okay. And then I pulled out shimmering lights because the shimmer is so nice. But I don't know what I'm painting, so don't judge me. All right. Um, we need a paintbrush. And I'm using watercolor paper. This is actually a really nice journal. One of my faves. Bright and bold or muted in fall. Bright and bold, muted or fall. Bright and bold, muted or fall. You decide. Uh-oh, Karen wants the journal. Karen doesn't even know what I'm painting in here yet. Bright and bold. All right. Bright and bold it is. Bright and bold. Um, all right. Well, now I have to paint something that Karen might like. No pressure. Bright and bold. Bright and bold. Bright and bold. Well, Julie wants frigid and bold. Well, good luck with that. I'm kidding. All right. Let's paint. Put on your red dress and paint the blues. Uh, any questions before I begin? No? Begin. Okay. I have a brush. An eight round, probably nothing. Nope, it's a six round. I was wrong. Oh, Karen says, I don't, doesn't matter. Karen, do you know my email address? All right. Oh, you guys, now there's pressure. Now there's pressure. I feel pressure. All right. I'm just going to go for it, you guys. I have to just go for it. That's all I'm going to do. This is the terrain set. Terrain. I'm going to give them a good lubing. Just wet those bad boys up. Why do you do that? Give them 30 seconds. Separate the little friends from. If you guys are all emailing me right now, I'll have a problem. But it's, it's like the first one. I, I just. Okay, wet, 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 wet. Wet, 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 wet. I should just start dropping color. Like, I love the, how bright and bold these are. The purple, okay. So I'm never, let's not get upset with me. We're just gonna, we're just gonna go for it. Oh, I just need to relax. I, I grabbed a bigger brush. I lied. I am gonna grab a number eight. All right. Water. Here are the colors. I said bright and bold. Bright and bold. Uh oh, there better be like a yeah. Ooh, that's a brass. That's just fun to say. I really don't know what we're doing, but Karen seems to think she's gonna like it. You said bright and bold though, so I'm gonna stick. I'm gonna really try to hit bright bold. That's what I'm going to try and do.
And I just noticed like if the water kind of ponds up because it is a little bit brand new journal, brand new, just took it out of the packaging. We'll put it right back in the packaging if somebody bought it. What I'll do is send me your email and then I'll just send you an invoice and I will take the painting part of it out. You don't have to pay for that. Ooh. Oh boy. Oh, okay. I'm super happy. Oh. Now, if you get a little bit of ponding, which I'm getting, what is ponding? Karen, just here's my email, love. Okay. I feel like she really wants it. And I don't know if I've gotten any emails. Probably strike a deal because I do need to. I do need some fail to die. But I never repeat anything either. People are really asking me when, uh oh, you guys, I didn't make sure that this was down tight. So if it's leaking all over the place, this is Karen's. I know her. She'll be fine. <laughs> Sorry, Karen. <laughs> All right. Ooh, I'm, I'm, I, now like a little bit of ponding. See, I just do this. My brush is dry. It's like a miracle. It just sops up all that water. I really did went a little nutty. I love these colors. I love these. Co oh, oh, let's go here. I love these colors. Ooh. I said bright and bold. You're getting bright and bold. That's what you're getting. I don't know what color that. Oh, yeah. Now I want this to dry reasonably. Oops. Pretty much. I'm just going back in now because I want it bolder. And what I want, I get. Okay. Um, and I'm going for it in 24, 24. I've got to figure out what my word of the year is going to be because according to my calendar, it's going to be go for it time. Okay, hey, we're going to let this dry. We're going to let this dry. And we're not going to touch it. We're just going to stare at it until no. I don't need to. I don't need to. It's going to move the water around. I do love these colors. I do have this set, by the way. Oh, I don't want the red to move over there. I just want the red to stay there. Okay, so I just tame it right back. You guys said bright and bold. You said bright and bold. You said bright and bold. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Go back over there. Is this bright and bold enough? Is this bright and bold enough? Remember, watercolors tend to, you know, lighten up a little bit. But if they do and it's not bright and bold enough for you, you can do this. And I'm just going to go in and add a little more color. I love the colors here. Uh, 
doesn't have to be perfect. Oops. Mm. I'm a little bit country. I'm a little bit rock and roll. Guess what I got today? Tickets to go see Chris Stapleton. My friend called me and said, I bought two extra tickets. Would you like to buy them? I'm like, uh, what? Uh, yes, because I've been online trying to get them. I'm really excited. I gotta feel like I gotta wait forever and ever and ever, but it's really not that long. All right, uh, I, I don't really need to, oops, whoa. Don't make mud, Tracy Ann. Uh, Y'all are asking me, I don't got one of those, but thanks for asking. Oh, boy. Uh oh I, I decided to go bolder, so I just dug right back in. I hope you don't mind. I want, I said bright and bold. I'm going to do bright and bold, even if it's just a little wackadoo. Oh, I always love when people say, I can't control my watercolors and I don't, um, and uh, they're not bold enough. Well, do another layer. Do another layer. There we go. Now I'm bolder. I love these colors that I'm so happy. Whoever gets this, I'm, I'm happy about that. Oop. Magic heat gun, drying everything off. I really hope. That I don't ruin this when I cover it with my drawing. All right. You know, after painting so much for the Art and Wine Festival, I just came back to my studio and didn't know what to paint. And I was like, I had kind of like painter's block. It was really disturbing. All right, we're just gonna let this go. And I'm not gonna touch it anymore because I'm afraid I'm gonna jack it all up. Beautiful colors, uh, thank you. I like them too. There's a lot of green in this set. This is the set, by the way. Uh, did anybody tune in for my uh, tea with Tracy? What did you think? I loved it. There was no pressure. I mean, I was drinking tea. I drink tea anyway. It was like a morning meditation. It was a small little project. I was thinking about making bookmarks. Um, you loved it. Okay, good. I, I got a lot of, oh, uh, Joanne loved it. Uh, Joanne was the one who got the postcard. So I need to start giving stuff away. I have so much art. When I do the art um, and wine, or when I do the art and wine, when I do the wine glass class, I give away the uh, glasses that I paint. And I'll ship them to you. I'll ship them to a winner. You guys tell me. I'm sorry. Well, I'm going to do it the first Friday. Uh, no, uh, Tea with Tracy is going to be the first Friday of the month. So December something, December 3rd. All right, I need a pen set. Oh, you know what I use? Oh, look at this. This is what my pen set has turned into. It was like they gave birth in, they're like two pen sets just jumped into the same packaging. I need to get just packaging. I know. Favorite pen set. I just threw everything that I owned in there. So I apologize. There's even random Sharpies in there, but you get it. Oh, good. Okay. I need to be able to draw a circle, like two circles. 
Uh, ooh. That's a circle, right? Yeah. Ooh. Knife. Heart. Okay. Two. This might have just two. Let's just make it two. Let's see if I can do this without messing it up. Okay. Oh, sorry, I just got dust from the bottom of this thing. Okay, don't move it. Don't move it. Uh oh. I feel like my. When when have you ever known me to want to draw a perfect circle? Well, that was annoying. Uh, I. I need a thick pen. Could maybe could I just look at the tops of the pens before I? Oh, there we go. Yes. Look at the top of the pen. There we go. We're just gonna go bold. Go bold. Oh, that's not a very good circle. Oh well. Who cares? Not me. If you're trying, oh, oh, if you're trying to make purple perfect circles in life, I'm probably not your girl because I just don't want that in my world. I don't want perfect. Oh. That's happy. That's happy. Oh, that's way too high up there. Okay, maybe there's a third one. <laughs> I lied. I need a smaller one. Need a smaller circle. We need a circle down here. Now let's just see how this turns out. All right. I just don't know what I'm doing tonight, do I? Ain't a happy flower. Uh oh. I don't know what I'm doing, but I'm gonna have some fun because that's who I am. Okay. Done singing wacky songs. I don't know. Where's this going? Well, that was a mess up. Well, oh, she go down, she go down. She gonna have a big leave. Mm. So for those of you who say you can't draw, obviously I cannot. <laughs> Uh-oh. I wonder if that's, is that light enough? Can you see what I'm doing? I hope you can see it. I'm just debating. Don't worry, I'm going to get much thicker lines going. Just really wanted something bold and happy. I feel like there's something over here. I just don't know what it is. Is it like a third one? Is it a third one? Why is my phone going off? What did I do? I think I'm just using the big, thick pen in this set. Thank 
Who's painting with me tonight? Who's just said, I'm gonna, just going to go for it with you, and I'm going to see where it takes me? It's like the best thing to do. If you're in your artful journey, this is your homework, kids. I feel like this might only warrant two flop. Ooh. Do I want a third one? <laughs> uh, I hear this on YouTube and I'm loving it. I saw Clear Star said, oh, I would love to, but I have to watch this while I work. Uh, I'm painting. Okay, good. People are painting. Uh, do I need a third flower on this or is this just all to the left or all to the right? Stand up, sit down, fight, fight, fight. Uh, you decide, you tell me. I could put like another third one or just call it a day and put something over here. I kind of feel like maybe I don't make this so busy that it's craziness, but I can put another smaller one. Because I was thinking about adding, I don't know what I'm thinking about adding. Just going bolder in my life. There's going to be some white. Uh, there is going to be some white in here. Maybe off in the distance. In the distance. Okay, hold on. Do I have something smaller? Ooh, 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 ooh. I know. Yeah, that's pretty small. She pretty small right there. Oh, yeah. Yep. Okay. <laughs> Inside of my scissors. Ooh, like this leaf was just waiting to happen. It formed in the paint. I could see it. Sometimes it just tells me what to do. I almost want little words stamped in there. I don't know. I think it's bright and bold, and I think it's happy. I am going to add some white, of course, because mm, oh, I mean, oh, I just I got more to add to this. I know it. You know it. We hold on. I'm looking. Oh, oh, oh! No, don't make a mess. Don't grab a bunch of stuff out that you have to put away, Tracy. That's not what we're doing tonight. Oh, I'm sweating in my office. It's so hot. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Piece of. Oh, yes. Into the tricks. Into the tricks now. Into the tricks. Oh. Oh, 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 oh. Mm. Mm. Just one. 
kind of something in there. Okay. I just wanted something in there. If I want something in there, I'm going to put something in there. All right. That makes me a lot happier. We're going to hope that this tape is going to hold because I don't really know if I pressed it down. By habit, it is kind of something I do. Okay. Now I'm going to grab my white paint and my liner brush. I'm going to put this on this thing. Like you could probably peel off all of that paint. I'm really happy that we got such bold colors with uh, watercolors for those of you who tell me you can't get bold colors out of watercolors. Well, yes, you can. Oh, and there is no live next week because I am traveling. I will be going to a shoe in somewhere, Texas, somewhere. So I will not be here. So we're going to take a week off. That doesn't mean you, you know, uh, we'll, we'll post like an old video or something, but I would anticipate that you're still going to uh, paint. You don't need me here to paint. I'm going to miss everybody. But I am going to be with Jelly Arts next week. Oh, something needs to be in the center of those flowers. Oh, like live, laugh, love. Oh. Do you think I could actually write or type that in? I will look. Oh, Mike, there is a rogue hair on my liner brush. Nothing worse. I mean, obviously, there's things that are worse, but. Oh, that rogue hair is going to drop me nits. It's time to put this brush out to pasture. What do you think? You don't need to know how to draw to do what I try to get you all to do. All right. I know I have my own stamps, by the way, are on sale this month. Hold on. Okay. Hold on. Oh, live, laugh, love. <laughs> like such the thing to say, but I do have it. I mean... I don't know if you'll be able to see it. Or do I? Um, will you see it? Liv? Can I fit it? I don't think I can fit it. Oh, where did it go? Oh, there it goes. I don't think I can fit it. Oh, uh, man. Mm. Okay, do I have just a thing to put right there? I'm looking. I'm looking. I'm looking. Give me a second. I, I have to put these little words back, otherwise I lose them. Nice that my stamps are literally like 
this one jig. Oh, by the way, I'm a ding dong. Uh, I admit that. Guess who has circle stamps? Um, hello. <laughs> um, huh. Hmm. Well, wouldn't you know it? You know, I could just write the words in because I do have decent handwriting for heaven's sakes. Oh, how about BU or something like in the middle that I send a message? Because this is the lightest one. And it says B. Can I fit that big one? May you. I don't. Uh, I could stamp in white, but I don't have a white stamp pad, and I am not pulling out embossing powders because that would be, you know, I'm just going to write something. I mean, it's just, but I should use my stamps for the next thing. Or just leave it and move on. Hmm. I know what I'm doing. I got it. I got it. Just. I'm just to stamp on an angle and to OCD for that. I can't do it. But I got it. 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 I mean, I got to add something to this. It needs a little zhuzhing. Okay. You know, when in doubt, polka dot. You know? Love me a good dot. I mean, this is a free demo. It's not a free 17-day workshop. I just got to move on. What time is it anyway? Oh, we're good. We're good on time. I literally love... We got to figure out if the paint all dripped underneath this too. Look, I made everybody happy. I did watercolors and acrylics. I just molded them together. Oh yeah, golly, I love, I love dots. Um, really don't want to jack this up anymore. I don't want to mess with it. I don't want to go over those dots. If there was something small I could write in there. I don't know who's getting this. Would they want it? Does it ruin your stamps to put acrylic paint on them? No, uh, but you do need to wash them off right out. There is a way to do it. Oh, I can try that if I mess it up. I've done it before. I've got this white paint, but I put those dots in there. So now I have a problem. No, I absolutely can, um, but you have to do a very thin, It's there's a technique involved. I used to be really good at it. I used to be really, really, really good at it. You got to do it. You And you got to watch those stamps up right away. Because stamp acrylic, they do not like it. I'm actually kind of thrilled with the way this is. Ooh, that rogue hair is just going to really upset me. Oh. 
Okay. Oh, they just said draw a heart. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to draw three hearts, not just one. I really want to seal this with a sheen. I think that's going to make it pop even more. So I'm going to go in a well ventilated area and seal it with a. Of course, I need these all to dry. Whoa. Do we think that the water, that the paint leaked all underneath it? Should I take a picky poo? I think I should take a peek and see before I go. See. Oh, no, looks good. Okay. Let me just take a peek before I seal this. I just want to see if I have. Oh, she could. Uh, name this painting, please. Could you name this painting in three notes? Oh, golly. Okay, go back down because I popped you. This painting is going to have to sit here and dry because I like. I have to take the plastic. I have to take the tape off though. But let's just give it a minute. Tracy winds up with pyro hearts. Oh, oh, oh. What do you think about that? What do you think about that? Okay. Okay. Put this away. All right. I do um, list everything and I do put it on my blog. I just want to seal this real quick, even though it's not trying. Let me just touch it and then. And I need to take this in a well ventilated area. You guys, I have to run outside real quick and spray this and give it a little sheen a -roo. Okay, be right back. Be right back. Be right back. Okay, it's just a quick look. Talk amongst yourselves. Okay, oh, sorry about that. It's pretty the binding. I usually cover that. Okay, ready? We're done. Whoops, no, we're not done. I just got stuff all over my hand. Now my hands are sticking. Okay. Here we go. Okay, wake that up. Wake that up. Whoops. All right. Well, that's all right. Oh, I normally heat the tape up, but it's coming off like blah. Nope. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, ready? Oh, 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 oh. You know what? I wish, oh, I didn't work that. Oh, my, oh, whoops. Go back down. Oh, what are you doing? It's because I use that heat gun. Oh, okay. Always, oh, every time you use aerosols, make sure it's a well ventilated area. Okay. And then wipe that off because you don't want to. I will list all of the supplies and my blog. Everything gets listed, I promise, with links. Uh, I left the cam sitting on the front porch. <laughs> yeah, everybody, I used a, uh, a spray sealer Americana, but I left the can on the front porch. I just dropped it on when it was on the floor. Uh, but da, 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 sign your name. Sign your name, sign your name. Okay, this painting, I will send an in invoice for the journal itself. The journal was brand new. I took it right out of the packaging. It needs a few days to, to it, it is a watercolor art journal. Ooh. Okay, and then I close it all up like so. Okay, there you go.
Uh, oh. <laughs> Can somebody name this? By the way. Can somebody name it? Okay. Um, I'll continue to do that if you guys like. Uh, the painting is for free, but the journal is not. I'm sorry. Uh, but if you do want to order a journal, I do paint them. There's a $25 charge. I added that because when I didn't add it, uh, I had to paint 37 journals in like three nights. And I realized I can't make an occupation or pay my mortgage by painting everybody's uh, journals. Uh, but I, oh, uh, bring it off. Any more names? Any more names? Somebody suggested Summer's Eve, but that reminds me of something. Well, I think I got paint on me too. Um, who, pop the flowers or pop of flowers. I like Genevieve, Summer Eve. Oh, Summer Eve. But do you know what I'm... Uh, yeah, I don't know if you guys know what I'm talking about, but... <laughs> Sorry, I just say things that pop into my brain and I can't like stop them. My filter is fairly beautiful, it's fairly good, but it just happens. Oh, I just convinced somebody on the watercolors. Boo, 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 boo. Okay, uh, that set of watercolors I used was called Terrain. And when I got it, I thought it looks all like it's just like greens and so I love it. I do love it. All right. <laughs> Everybody knows what I mean. <laughs> when you really want a good cleaning. <laughs> I don't think so either. <laughs> I hope there's only women watching because I think I lost any male listeners. Oh my God, uh, we're done early. I finished two minutes early. It doesn't take a long time to make. I encourage you all to take your art outside the art journal. Remember, don't get stuck. There's many places to go, like wood. <laughs> You gilly. Okay. I swear, there are some of the best moments that have come from our Wednesday nights. And I encourage you to paint. Uh, share your paintings with me. If you're in the group Art Journaling for Beginners, you can share it in there. Uh, if you're a member of your Artful Journey, you should automatically be going and sharing all of your artwork there because you know that's where I check first thing in the morning. I don't know what our live dates are for November. I have a feeling though they're when I get back. Wait a minute. Yeah. Uh, this is my calendar. I mean, I don't see any of oh, Creative Time Live on the 20th. We have morning meditation on Friday. Don't forget this Friday, kids. Okay. <laughs> all right. I have been looking at that calendar. It makes scaring me. Uh, all right. Love seeing you. I have been with you for years. I love that you're still being fun, bring fun and beauty to our world. Oh, Mary Lee, thank you. That's so nice. Uh, so I'll email immediately the person. I don't ship it out for a few days. You know why? It smells like the sealer, and everything needs to dry. So there you go. Have a wonderful evening. I appreciate you guys. If you weren't watching, it would probably be kind of awkward that I was sitting here by myself painting and talking to myself. But uh, I tend to do that anyway. I will list all of the supplies. What time is morning meditation? 8 a.m. Pacific Standard Time. Can I fit? Can I spray poly acrylic? I don't know what that is. I don't. Uh, I don't know, Polly. 
I don't know probably what that is. I, I use a spray. I, I'll share the sealer. I just left it on the porch. Uh, I have a link and everything. Uh, and be careful with watercolors. You don't want to take a brush on sealer because that could reactivate the watercolors. Water, you don't want to reactivate anything or re-wet them because they could run all off your page. Uh, same thing with water soluble pencils, water soluble markers, anything with aqua, water. Okay. You just gotta be careful of it. I've had it happen. What a work of art. Smear. Have a wonderful evening. I will not be here next Wednesday because I will be somewhere in the great state of Texas. I don't know exactly. I know I landed Dallas and I picked up and I've driven for an hour or so. Um, and then uh, it's a very quick trip. I think I go Wednesday to Saturday. Thank you, Tracy. Uh, have a wonderful week and do something creative every day. For those of you who are in your artful journey, I'll see you Friday. For those of you who are taking my wine glass class, I'll see you Monday. Talk to y'all soon.